for everything. What's like there's like a meme that it's like thirty percent of anything is trash. Like thirty percent of movies, thirty percent of all art, thirty percent of like all anime, right? Like thirty percent of given thing is going to be trash. But you have to have that thirty percent of the trash so you can get the like seventy percent that's good. The 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 quality you have a fixed amount of quality and you can only yeah. distribute it in in de- in that many isekai yeah and... quality quali- quality is like a finite resu- resource that we mine using children in africa we have to send the the kids into the into the the quality mines okay? the sakuga mines <laughs> the sakuga mines can't be used again. We have to. We have to mine more. Send more kids to the. Ch- the kids yearn for the mines. Oh no! <laughs> they yearn for the mines. So, so, so risky... shown and good is what I'm getting from this. Also, <laughs> shown and good. It's not that you should take risk. It's that you should just burn out every employee that you have. Yeah, just just work your employees to do. Look, they have to go into the quality mines, Ellie. We have to send the kids yeah. into the sweatshops. <laughs> have to send the kids into the sweatshops, okay? Like you don't understand. Also, uh, um, same with concept was a bad idea. The problem lies in the excess quantity of shows in the genre that are being produced, which ends up leading to a lower quality overall in those shows. The- mm-hmm. Like Is the problem true? with this. Yeah, but the problem with his thesis is his thesis is based on a faulty premise, right? Because he's basing his entire thing on the premise that, oh, there's like all of these, like 25 isekais a year, and that means that a percentage of them are trash. It's like, yeah, that's that's the same for everything. What's like, there's like a meme that it's like 30% of anything is trash, like 30% of movies, 30% of all art, 30% of like all anime, right? Like, 30% of given thing is going to be trash, but you have to have that 30% of the trash so you can get the, like, 70% that's good, right? Also, this or, like, is... decent. This, well, uh, I, I, I heard that before, but it sounds kind of, you know, sounds very... Icky. It's like I see it, it's, it's, a, it's a meme. It's like meme Yeah, all right, yeah. As, like... a, as a meme, it makes more sense, because it's, it's, a, it's yeah. an actual I don't, theory. I don't, think it's, sounds... I don't think it's, like, I don't think it's, like, actual, like, quantifiably provable, but it's, like, yeah, but it's like a it's vibe, a, right? It, it, <laughs> it's because... a vibe. <laughs> also, what is good depends on the person, etc. Anyway, um, yeah, 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 yeah. The, um, the premise that Naretsu, next season, Every single mm-hmm. show is an isekai. Oh shit! Oh no! What are Does we gonna that do? mean that because all of them are isekai, the quality of all those isekais is lower? That somehow the 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 quality you have a fixed amount of quality, and you can only yeah. distribute it in in de- in that many isekai. Yeah, and... quality quali- quality is like a finite resu- resource that we mine using children in Africa. We have to send the the kids into the co- into the the quality mines. Okay? The Sakuga mines. <laughs> the Sakuga mines. And we, we send mine... we send the we we send the Chinese sweet shop kids into the into the Sakuga mines. And then we mine the Sakuga and 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 pour it into the and studios. Th- yeah, yeah, yeah. We 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 no. We, that, that it has to be refined in the sweatshops that have like you know you know about the Chinese sweatshops that have like the suicide nets. Oh crap! Mm-hmm. The video is probably going. The video is probably going to get. I a already note mentioned I that I'm partaking <laughs> sexual violence, so don't worry. Yeah, <laughs> we're going to get a note, or we're going to get restricted because I said the word. <laughs> but you get yeah, like it goes into the. You has to get refined. In the buildings where the, where the nets are to stop the people from jumping off, right? And then, and then once it's refined into like bars, right? The quality bars, then the bars get sent to the studios, and the studios use them. And and, and once they've once they've used the bar, it's 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 used up. It's used Can't up quality. Used. Can't be used again. We have to we have to mine more. Send more kids to the ch- the kids yearn for the mines. Oh no, <laughs> they yearn for the mines. So, this idea, this, this, this stupid idea of, oh, if there are more isekai coming out, then the quality of all those isekai will drop for 
yeah. Why then I think that, what mechanic? I, I, we 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 explained the mechanic, but what is his explanation? Well, I think it ties into like what I was talking about before with the meme about thirty percent, right? Because let's say like yes, you had a season where it was every single show was an isekai. Like obviously, a good amount of them, maybe not thirty percent, but a good amount of them are going to be shit. But then you'll probably have a good percent of them that's also good, right? Because that's just how it sort sort of works, you know. Yeah, but I'm still I'm still running into the issue of what if you just don't like? Um, yeah, what if you just don't like it? Yeah, this this show that I have on screen, right? Incorporates some sci-fi yeah. elements, right? They have guns, they have some power armor thingy going on, or what? Or whatever, yeah. yeah so yeah. Uh, if you don't, if you hate science fiction in this isekai, then this isekai is trash, and you don't watch it. So does it? Is the quality wasted, or if somebody really loves sci-fi in isekai and the show doesn't have yeah. it, so. Exactly. exactly. It gets real iffy because, you know, quality is subjective at at some point. Yeah, it it gets really iffy really quick, yeah. But anyway, let's keep going. Genre lose. That's more important than economics. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) That's not to say that there aren't studios out there taking risks. Look at MAPPA. MAPPA took the risk of fan backlash when they took in the Attack on Titan for Season 4, when which studio could no longer handle it. In that very same year, they released Jujutsu Kaisen, which would take the shonen fanbase by storm. If you thought that was enough, fuck you, because MAPPA's taking it one step further this year, releasing not only Part 2 of Attack on Titan's final season, but also the anticipated Chainsaw Man and a Jujutsu Kaisen movie. And MAPPA isn't alone in this journey of making quality shows. So- so, the so risky... shown and good is what I'm getting from this. Also, <laughs> shown and good. It's not that you should take risk; it's that you should just burn out every employee that you have. Yeah, just just work your employees to do. Look, they have to go into the quality mines, Ellie. We have to send the kids yeah. into the sweatshops. <laughs> have to send the kids into the sweatshops. Okay, like you don't understand. Also, uh, um, Sam was right. This isn't this isn't taking extra risk, risk right? Continue no, it's with- not because because fucking Jujutsu Kaisen, right, and Chainsaw Man, and Attack on Titan were all massive fucking mangas before they got an anime. There's no risk there. They were already like proven, right? Like they were selling fucking shitloads of copies of manga, right? You, so you can't sit here and tell me, oh man, Chainsaw Man was such a risk, Ellie. <laughs> Such a risk. Yeah, the, the manga that literally everyone was talking about back then, right, as being this next big thing, right? Totally a risk. Oh, no, right? no. Do totally. you know the biggest risk ever of Demon Slayer? Where Yeah, yeah, it, Demon Slayer. Oh, no, yeah, that movie was risk. such a risk. Half of the population yeah. of Japan apparently watched it, or at least tickets yeah, enough for the half like of that. the population of Japan have, have yeah. seen the the Demon Slayer movie that was such a risk to make, my dude. Yeah, yeah, it's it's fucking. And this again, this comes from his level of ignorance, right? Because he doesn't understand the the pipeline, right? He's thinking, oh man, they took a ri- they, they made these animes and they took on all these projects, and that was a risk. It was such a big thing, you know. <laughs> Would Fire Punch be a risk? <laughs> <laughs> god maybe maybe fire because i've heard some shit i haven't read it yet but i've heard some shit about fire punch that one that one might be a risk but like but you get what i'm saying right it's like these 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 were already like proven right and if we're gonna look at this from a corporate point of view right buying like licensing to create an anime on something that's already selling gazillion million copies of manga is not a risk. Okay, no, I'm sorry. original manga, original anime. That is that is that is the big so, risk. Something like Metallic Rogue is an actual risk. Or you know, right? Darling it's in Metallic the Fangs, Rogue. Kill a Kill, um, a bunch yeah. of trigger stuff is was basically a risk. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So anyhow. It's good. <laughs>